Hey guys, as promised, we're back to do the second video on this Monday doubleheader. This is a Patreon request from this patron right here, and he asked us to do Colossus Stone Burner, the official music video. I must say, uh, I've never heard of this band or this song. I have absolutely no clue. I, I, I couldn't even find them on Metal Encyclopedia, so I don't. I, I, for all that I know, this could be his friend's band. I, I honestly, I've, I the only Colossus I know is the movie theater by our house. It's called the Colossus. It's not on Metal Encyclopedia. Who, who the movie theater? No, no these there. guys. No, I could. I found three Colossus. I don't think any of them were these guys. Uh, I don't think so. Uh, anyways, they're off the grid. Yeah, maybe maybe they're off the grid. Maybe they believe in conspiracy theories and they're off. They live off the grid. They live in one of those uh, tin hats. Yeah, just, one of those tin hats. Let's just hope that uh, this can save the doubleheader. Wow, you feel like the doubleheader right now is going to shit? Not going to shit, but it... it I know you only gave the previous one a one Nelson. I gave it two Nelsons and a Winnie Mandela. But I, I know that. But seriously, like, you, you're really putting all your hopes on a band called Colossus, a video called Stoneburner, from a band that I cannot find on, on metal, metal Encyclopedia. Really, based on what I just told you, you really think this is going to be what's going to save this doubleheader? Really? I think the I think the really? Nelson Mandela joke was the one that saved the doubleheader. I, I you know what? I I'm, I agree so much with you that I'm not even going to say anything. All right, let's do this. This looks like a regular show at the rock pile. Yeah. There's more people playing than people are watching.
fortunate enough to witness the use of such a weapon are rendered blind. Eyes become empty sockets. To use a stone burner is to risk planetary destruction. Depending on the amount of fuel present, the device can burn a planet to its core. That's probably his cousin. High fiving him after that show. All right, uh, I have a few things to say. Uh, you went first for the previous one. Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna go first on this one. I had no idea the Flying Dutchman Ruben. You know Ruben that has the reaction channel on YouTube. Ruben Buis Buches whatever. I can't pronounce his last name. He's Dutch, anyways. I had no idea he had a metal band. And and apparently he does, and he does, and he travels probably to the U.S. to do some gigs here and there. I had no idea, so I learned something new from this video. That Ruben, uh, our good friend Ruben from his YouTube channel, Ruben, I can't see his last name, Buges, 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 Fine Dutchman. Let's go with Fine Dutchman. Fine Dutchman. Actually, Fine Dutchman. Uh, yeah, let's go with that. Fine Dutchman. I had to think who you're talking about. It's Ruben. He's yeah. a Dutchman. So, anyways, uh, he's in a band. So now that we got that out of the way, um, was I right? In your opinion, because in I, my opinion, in my opinion, the song wasn't that bad. Uh, let me start with the video. Nothing matched in the video. No, because when he, the, he would continue to stop saying, <laughs> "Yeah," that was, like, that was that was something that caught me off guard. It was like one of those those old Bruce Lee movies. Yeah, you know right. what I mean? Like it, nothing, nothing was was like. First of all, the audio was obviously not from the live performance. No. The audio was from studio, or uh, I mean, the audio sounded like it was recorded inside a barrel. But anyways, um, nothing was really matching. The video was really distracting from their perspective because it's like Stone Burner. Nobody's saying Stone Burner. Not even the backup guys are. Not even the guitar guys saying no. Stone Burner. Like nobody's like burning any stones. So that was really distracting. I've said this before, and I'll say it again. I understand that you don't have a lot of budget. You don't have a lot of money. But you want to get your music out there. You want to get your sound out there. Make it a lyric video. Exactly. I mean, I'm sure you can you can muster up a couple of hundred dollars and pay somebody to do a lyric Not video for you. Or you can Google probably slides. do it. Huh? Google Slides. Or or just Google Slides it and do it yourself. Whoa, whoa. Listen, whatever it takes. There's no second first impression. There's only one first impression. If I am anybody in the music business and I'm looking at booking a band or whatever, and this is what I get as far as the video to introduce me to your band, after the first five, maybe five is a little bit too short, the first 25 seconds, I'm turning it off. Because it's like, what is this? What is, what is this? When we live in a digital era where where people make like great things on an iPad or, or on an iPhone or, or something. So anyways, disappointing. Moving on now to the song. I'm not. I'm not gonna. I'm not willing to say that this was better than two Nelson Mandela's and one Winnie Mandela. I'm now. I'm not ready to do that. But there is some potential there. Those two solos, the the, the two guitar solos, were really good. They were. They were above average. I would say they were above average. And perhaps they are the only highlight that I can take away from this listening experience. Oh, is those two solos. The chorus. Stone burner. To be honest with you, I found his voice. It didn't do it for me. It didn't. No. I'm just. You have a high taste. You're like you're like the Gordon Ramsay of reaction videos. <laughs> oh, wow! We should rename our channel to Reaction Nightmares. Wow. Uh, you know what I mean? Or at least have a section where we do just AMP, reaction. Uh, AMP nightmares. AMP nightmares. All right. So uh, the, no, I I, I didn't. Was it wasn't to my taste. 
No, the, I, I found the whole song a little bit flat. It just didn't do it for me. Th- there yeah, was he n- didn't have he didn't have the type of vocals he like. He had he had he hit those high notes, but like he, needs he, to want, go higher. he has to go higher. He has to go higher. That yeah. was for me. The song was for me. The song was good. I don't, if I was right, I'm gonna say this. Couple of things, right? So I like the solos. I'm yeah. not gonna deny the solos were good. I really yeah. enjoyed the, enjoyed the solos on this track. But this is my point. If you're gonna, the, the song will sound like a stoner rock song. If you're gonna go with that vibe, the, uh, your vocal approach has to be different, in my opinion. This the song more grasp, a little bit graspier, a little bit maybe a lower tone and whatever. And if you're gonna go with that more of a, because he was kind of like caught in, in the middle, like he's not like. You know, he wasn't going really high, he wasn't really going any low, he was just like he was in having a good middle. time in the middle, you know what I mean? For me, it doesn't cut it. Like, I, a band like this, you hear a dime a dozen, It's not. there's nothing, like, to me, I didn't feel like there was anything really unique unique or special that I could say, wow, you know, I would like to check out more of these guys, you know, what they're all about. Maybe they're like a small band, but there's some potential there. You know, I we mean, they weren't on, they weren't on middle and six uh, so. let, let me put it this way: we did a band from a bunch of kids from Minnesota called Agony Reigns. Yeah. Remember that band from Minnesota? We did. They got in touch with us uh, from Minnesota. Bunch of kids. Tell me if that video wasn't better. Oh. The quality of the video that those kids put together. Hey, it wasn't a Bruce Lee right? movie. It wasn't a Bruce Lee movie. And the sound. The sound was really good. Those guys were really good. There was some really good thrash metal. So I'm not saying that this is bad. I'm sure somebody's happy about it. Somebody likes it. Obviously, somebody likes it enough that they ask us to check the video. Me personally, it's just I like the two solos, and I like the intro. When the song started, I was like, "Wow, this has some potential. Yeah. I really like where this is going. It has a little bit of a psychedelic vibe, a little bit of a stoner vibe. I, I really well, like where this is going." Start, right when it started, I was like, "Oh, I'm proving you wrong. This is going to be the one that." Like, I thought so too, man. When the song started, I was like, "Oh my god, he's going to be right. This song is he's going to be right." When he started singing, I was like. Yeah, just there's not enough there. Not enough for me personally. Not enough there. For 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 me, I thought you know the guitar, the guitar solo is really really good. The guitar solo. I'm not taking that away. The guitar solo. And I like I like the the chorus is really nice and catchy. I mean, it's kind of hard to forget the the chorus. Still on pattern. Yeah, but his vocals to me they were they're okay with the with the song. They could have been he could have hit higher notes if he did hit those higher notes. Especially in the chorus. Especially in the chorus. Like Probably the first time you say stone burner, then the second time stone burner. Yeah. Like give give put more passion into it. Perfect. Perfect. Okay. Perfect. That's exactly what I was looking for. Perfect. I heard the other day a band that sent me a CD to check them out and whatever. I I, I didn't I listened to half a track and I put it away. Why? Because it felt to me that everything in the song they were just going through the motion. I didn't feel like there was any passion in what they were doing. The drums were like daisy. The guitar was like, you know, I know you're having a good time, but but feel what you're singing about. Put some some energy, like you know, put some 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 oomph into the performance. You know what I mean? That's all. All right, this is it. Yeah. All right. This was um. The bar has been really lowered with this Patreon request. I must this say. double header kind of. But the, the, we've done it. We th- this month, I must say, we've had a couple of duds on the Patreon requests. Yeah, yeah. I think the the best thing about this double letter was the Nelson Mandela's and yes. the idea of adding that. Yeah, I agree. I agree. Uh, maybe perhaps that's what we can take away. Yeah. And by the way, the, both songs had good solos. Yeah. Let's not forget that. And and the, the drums both, on the songs, first track. Both songs had stuff that were good, but, but just not enough. Not enough stuff that were good compared to the ones that were bad. Exactly. Exactly. The 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 cons outweighed the pros. Yeah. All right, guys. This is it for this double header. But come back tomorrow. We'll have more videos for you. See you guys. See ya.